The Carolina Hurricanes revealed a new throwback jersey for this season, and the San Jose Sharks officially unveiled their new home and road uniforms. It's been a busy week on the jersey front, and as for me, I could not be farther from the ice. This is an Aesthetics Flash Report for September 16th. I'm Chris. Thanks for watching. So it figures that just when I decide to take a few days away in Hawaii, NHL teams decide it's a good time to start dropping new uniforms. Let's start with the big news out of Raleigh on Thursday. For their 25th anniversary, the Hurricanes will wear a new third jersey modeled after their inaugural look from 1997. It also matches what they wore during their first Stanley Cup championship in 2006. The team is calling it vintage, which is a hard word for us 90s kids to hear. And anyway, it marks the return of the storm flag stripes and silver accents, along with the original single flag shoulder patch and the old name and number font. Inside the collar, though, is a reminder of the club's 25th season, all beautifully executed by Adidas. This jersey comes just weeks after the Canes officially made their black third jersey their primary home uniform for 2022 and retired the red one. It left them with home and road sweaters that do not feature their primary logo at all. But this new alternate ensures that a red jersey with the main logo stays in the mix. The Canes say they'll wear this jersey 12 times during the season, which leaves room for a game or two in their green Whalers throwback, which has become an annual tradition. I don't know for sure if they plan to wear it this year, but if they do, Carolina will become the first ever NHL team to wear six different jerseys in the same season. And that is a lot of jerseys. Now let's shift back to San Jose. Thanks to all the recent leaks, they've been featured a lot here on Aesthetics lately, but now it is officially official. On Wednesday at an event for season ticket holders, the Sharks showed off their new look and answered the big question I had. Would they keep the teal pants and helmets? And it turns out, they did. Teal from head to toe. While the Canes used vintage to describe their new release, the Sharks are calling this their Evolve uniform, as it's an evolution of their original look from 1991, which remains popular to this day. Understandably though, they didn't want to simply trot out the old design, they wanted to push it forward, which I can certainly appreciate. The sleeve stripes with the wave pattern are a superb touch, the custom name and number font are a solid upgrade from the uninspired block lettering they had previously, and the teal gear really shows you how a team can own a color. Nobody does it quite like San Jose. I also love the revised fin logo for the shoulders. It's an improvement in every way. The evolution of the Sharks brand has been great, but part of me wonders if they could have updated the primary logo to match that new secondary mark. But I guess that's how evolution works, one step at a time. And that's all I've got for now. Remember to like this video on your way out and subscribe if you haven't yet. Thanks again and see you next time.